Hi, I'm Dr. Andy. Today we are interviewing Kim Jordan. She manages and owns um, Almance Coffee Works and Converge Coffee and Cafe uh, here in Burlington and Graham. Um, so Kim, thank you for joining us today. Uh, when did you decide to get into coffee? So it happened about two years ago. Um, the other two owners, Jen and Daniel Krenzer and Kevin and myself all met at CrossFit Gym. And at the time, CrossFit Daniel, 584, different CrossFit right? 584, yeah, yeah. yes. That's our favorite. <laughs> <laughs> and Daniel was actually roasting coffee in his garage as okay. just a hobby. He'd bring it for Kevin and I to try. And then um, he got pretty good at it. And so we started buying it. But we were kind of like his... From Daniel. From Daniel. Okay, so you guys were like his first customers. Yes, Ooh, yes. Okay. And we um, would give him feedback, you know, okay. around the different coffees and... So then Kevin started telling Daniel, you know, this is really, this is really good good coffee. You want to, you want to go somewhere with this or, you know, so, um, they had a drink, shook hands and said, let's start Alamance Coffee Works. Daniel had already named it Alamance Coffee Works. Okay. So, but was that was around two years ago? Yeah, it was about two years ago. And then they started roasting in it. All with a handshake. I like it. Little, a little larger roaster. (laughs) Yeah. And you guys have bought a new roaster here just recently, haven't you? We did. Yeah, we used to have a three-pound roaster, and now our roaster can roast about 30 pounds. Oh, my God. You said three-pound to to 30 30 pounds. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's more coffee for me. I'm excited. That's exactly right. (laughs) So what makes um, the coffee that Alamance Coffee Works produces so special? So the guys are really, um, I have been really careful in choosing who we actually buy our coffee from. And then in choosing the coffee, the grade of bean that they choose, they always choose a really high uh, grade of bean. Um, They ask lots of questions about the farms, the farmers, and then of course just the roasting process. They are always learning and um, being very attentive. They have, if you come to the roaster or the roastery, we have log books of times and temperatures and pulls and can you tour um, can you visit the roastery I'm, I'm sure daniel and kevin would love to show you the roastery oh gosh, be, okay no i would love it no i'm obsessed with their coffee their coffee is so good yeah so it's a lot of time and, and attention and attentiveness and constant learning constant learning yeah shoot that sounds like sounds like what i have to do yeah <laughs> for sure yeah. this summer you guys opened a brick and mortar converge um coffee bar and cafe what made you guys decide to, to do that yeah so there were a couple factors in that um you know we've had the roastery about two years mm-hmm. now and so our customer base has really grown and they kept wanting to come to the roastery and have a cup of coffee yep. and we had to keep explaining that the roastery was just a roastery like you can come see the big machine but we're not making coffee and selling coffee there cu- cups of coffee right yeah. so um which would be a huge disappointment right 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 so um the demand from our customers was was pretty good. much growing so you started with the demand that's good yes yeah. And then um, our coffee was being um, sold at the co-op in downtown Burlington at the mm. time. Okay. And then, unfortunately, that went yeah, out of exactly. business. So a large um, portion of our customers weren't able to get our coffee at a, a store that was close to them. And most of those customers were from the west side of town or downtown. And so we um, decided to give them I was say, what, Is that what led you to kind of open more towards yes. downtown or yes. down Church Street? Yep. Mm-hmm. It sure was. Yeah, so we wanted to provide them, you know, a way. Of course, they can order online, but, you know, a lot of people just sure. want to go pick it up. So, yeah. yeah. So obviously, I, I know I'm biased. <clears throat> I'm obsessed with mm-hmm. coffee. I love coffee. And I've, you know, been to all of the different, like, coffee shops here in, in Burlington. And it seems like since I've found you guys, like, I can barely drink the other <laughs> stuff. So I'm obviously biased. What makes, like, Converge better? What, ma- what makes the coffee so good? So there are a few things about Converge that are different than other coffee shops. And there are some great coffee shops in Burlington. And, and they may do one of these things, but Converge just kind of pulled them all together. And one so of those... coffee purists. Um, yeah, we are. <laughs> And we love to help people and educate them on that. So, um, and that's one of the things that's different about Converge. Our menu is a European traditional menu, mm-hmm. and so we serve what does that coffee. Mean? So we serve coffee the way it's served all around the world. Okay. We've not modified it to just an American way. So if you sugar, <laughs> sugar. Well, you know. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna say that, but yes. Yeah. Um, so, for instance, if you come to Converge and order a macchiato, and then you go to Italy and order a macchiato, it's going to be the same. the same macchiato. Yeah. So that's one thing that's... That, I did that's, not know that. Yeah. That's, that's um, 
you know, unique to us. Um, and then also the value add experience when you come to Converge, um, you know, our baristas or whoever's working there at the time can speak about our coffee. Um, they can speak to the roast. They can speak to the notes. Highly they, knowledgeable. Mm -hmm, they can educate you, um, you know, as much as you want or as little as you want. Gotcha, gotcha. Um, on, on the coffee or its process or, you know, anything to do with that. And some people really, Which, really enjoy it. I mean, it, it shows a lot to you guys to spending that time in training and educating your own employees. Yeah. Yeah. Which that's, is special. That's good. Yeah. In fact, we're getting ready to do training this, this weekend, me and all the baristas. So. Smart. Yeah. So the, oh, oh, the other thing is we have our, um, all of our syrups or our mixes that we make, our chai mix, our hot chocolate. We make those in house, which means we control Delicious. the amount yeah. of sugar. We control the ingredients. We get to buy locally. So that's huge. Locally. Yeah. It's one of those like keywords that we That's all right. love, right? Well, okay. Which is kind of leading me into my next question because I was going to ask. I know that health was like a big part of what you guys were going for and having healthy options. So what are the healthy options um, that you guys, you know, paid so much attention to when you guys were designing your cafe menu? Yeah, so, you know, having the inception happen in a CrossFit gym or yeah. CrossFit 584 yeah. gym you know, it kind of goes without saying that that was something we all were passionate about as yeah. well. And so a lot of people don't know that, that Converge has these other options other than just a cup of coffee. While right. the coffee has great benefits, um, you can also come there and get smoothies that are made with organic produce, organic yeah. fruit. Um, you can add a scoop of protein in there. We also do a bullet for the, after coffee. the workout. For after the, the workout, that's right. Just hop, stop on over. Um, we have a Kevlar or Bulletproof coffee, which is heavy cream and the MCT oil, and we put it in a blender. It's one of the it's one of my favorites, creamiest. I'm I mean, obsessed with Bulletproof. I don't know if I've mentioned it yet. <laughs> bulletproof coffee is like how I start every yeah. morning. Yeah, it really is amazing yeah, stuff. It is. I mean, it boosts your focus. metabolism, yeah. and you know, I think it sets like the 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 rest of the day off right. It sure does. Yeah. Um, we also offer nitro coffee, which yep. um, is a great alternative to just a black cup of coffee. You know. It's stronger? Um, it's not stronger. It's just infused with nitro. In fact, we actually use a light roasted coffee. Okay. Nitrogen gas. It's infused with yep. nitrogen gas. Yeah. Okay. So it looks like a beer. So when you walk in your office in the morning with like nitro, it's like, things. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, um, and I would say too, with the healthy options, you know, just knowing where our pastries and our bakers are and, and that they're locally sourcing the foods that they bring into our shop is, is a big thing. And that does make it healthier. And we also offer teas from Asheville Tea Company, mm -hmm. and they actually grow some of their stuff in their teas here in Alamance County, which is amazing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then they grow uh, everything else there in Asheville. So, you know, it, it's really nice to know where your you, food you comes from. You guys have from. exciting news later this week for your new menu coming oh, out. Oh, yes, now. Friday. Yeah. That's exciting. Yeah. So, what other uh, exciting things are coming up for Alamance Coffee Works or Converge? Yeah, so Alamance Coffee Works... Um, you know, we there's a lot of behind the scenes things that happens I'm with sure. Alamance Coffee Works, and so the wholesale business is really, um, you know, picking up. And so we're we're really glad to be partnering with so many local places, and some of those are in the works, and some of them have already happened. You can get our coffee at Steve's Garden Market in Graham, yep. um, Trackside Bottling Company in Mebane, and then of course at Converge Coffee Bar. Um, yeah, you know, can always and come on, there online, right? And online, yep. yes, you can order it online. Yep, um, and. That that is expanding. I can't give out all the names yet, but okay. it is expanding. I get it. I get it. Um, and with Converge, our menu is expanding, so we're gonna have some more lunch options, toast options um, for the morning. We're also getting ready to launch a mobile app, so you can order on your um, mobile app and then get rewards, and it'll be waiting for you at Converge. So that early morning workout, right? Have that protein shake ready for you when you get done. So Perfect. I know you guys were in the works of that. I'm, yeah. I'm excited to know that it's coming out soon. Yes, it's very soon. Okay. Very, very soon. Yeah. Good. Um, we're also doing our beer launch on January 25th. We'll okay. have live music for that. So we do have beer in our shop in yep. case I forgot to mention that. Um, so, yeah, th that's, that's a lot. a lot going on. Yeah. Holy cow. Yeah. It's the happening place to be. It is that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Anything else you want to share? Um, oh, I didn't mention we have cold brew coffee, too, which is one of your yep, favorites. That is my favorite. Summer so... Time. Yeah, it is. It's a nice alternative too to just a, a hot cup of coffee. But since we're gonna have snow, you won't be wanting that anytime soon. <laughs> Thank you, Kim. Uh, all right. If you guys liked it, please share. Please comment below. 
Um, let us know uh, what else you want to see or any other uh, local healthy businesses that you, that you might be able to um, share with us. That would be wonderful. Um, remember Burlington to uh, live with passion, not pain.